Hi, I'm Carrie McCoy, founder of Arkansas Flag and Banner, now simply called FlagandBanner.com. And this is my husband, Grady McCoy. We've been in the business now for decades, and there's a lot of confusion about um, how to mount a flag to a flagpole, and there's a lot of options now. There used to not be very many options, and when they first invented this thing called a never furl, which has been quite a while ago, it was like a miracle because your flag would not wrap around your, because your outrigger flag that flies out from your home would not wrap around your flagpole. Now, they've come up with something called a spinning pole. This is even better. It's, it's, it's not, this idea has not been around that long, but if you have a flag or a banner with a pole sleeve, you can attach it right here to the tab inside of your pole sleeve, or if you have a flag with grommets, you simply Whoop, you don't want to hit anything. You simply slide these rings up to the top, and these screws go through the grommet of your flag. And there's a tutorial to show you how to do that on another page. Um, but today, we're going to give an example of the never furl. If you don't have a spinning pole, and you have at home a regular pole, and it, your flag keeps wrapping around your pole and you don't want to buy a new pole, you can buy the never furl again. It's not exactly perfect, but it's a great solution to a long time flag problem. And Grady's gonna kind of explain to you how it works. Sure. So you, uh, critical uh, part is the diameter of your pole. So if you have an existing three-quarter inch pole or an existing one inch diameter pole, be sure and buy the never furl for the one inch or three-quarter or one and a half inch, whatever diameter your pole is. Otherwise, it won't fit. So the never furl is basically four components. The larger cylinders here are the ones that remain free and spin and the ones that your flag are going to attach to. These thin cylinders are the ones that you fix in place and keep the big cylinders where they uh, should be. So this top cylinder is going to be above the fixed cylinder so that it doesn't slide down. This is the way it's going to be mounted off the side of your home. You'll attach the top of your flag to this hook right here. That one remains free like that mm -hmm. and then the bottom one the fixed cylinder is going to go above your loose cylinder so that keeps it from uh, go uh, being pulled up this way grab uh, the flag itself will keep this from sliding down so when you hook your flag here it holds it in place let's just go ahead and show it. okay because i think one of the, one of the mistakes that people make is they tighten the bottom and they tighten the top too tight. And then they call us and they say, why doesn't our never furl work? And so it's kind of hard to explain over the phone, so we want to show you. So these clips are just going right into the grommet. Top one above the fixed cylinder. And slightly loose, so it has, can spin. Bottom one holds in place here. You don't need to tighten anything here. And don't make these rings too tight against your spinning. So it's gonna come, the kit comes with an Allen wrench. It's got a set screw. Just loosen the set screw so it's in the right place. And then tighten it back. And see, we'll leave, let's say, uh, um, a little space there. Keep the flag loose here, little space here. Let's put this rest of the pole together so it looks like it actually will. So here we're gonna have a little space in there so the wind can move this flag around. And then when it loops over, it's gonna undo itself just like that. Thank you for watching. Hope this solves the problem of the never furl that might, that might be hanging up for you and not working perfectly. Again, it's not a perfect solution. We today love the spinning pole. If you, if, you, if you want to, you can just go ahead and move up to the spinning pole, which attaches straight 
to the flag and, and makes it have a little bit tighter to the pole when you when you buy the swing pole. Thanks for watching. Flagandbanner.com.